New data shows that Kentucky has the highest unemployment rate in the country at over 35 percent of the population. And despite promises, many people still haven't received their benefits. LEX 18's Eleanor Buckley spoke to a woman who's been forced to dip into her 401k just to pay the bills. Renata Manny filed for unemployment in April. She wasn't fired, but no longer felt safe working at Walmart. She says many of the customers didn't wear masks or practice social distancing. So she knew with her health issues, it wasn't a safe place for her to be. I have COPD and I, ha I have anxiety issues and I've done really good without any kind of medication and it just intensified with the way that the customers would get up on top of you, you you're trying to put something on the shelf and everybody just wants to grab and get right up on you and not give you any kind of space. My anxiety level got so high, I wasn't able to come home and function. So she decided to call the company that contracted her to stock shelves at Walmart. It's a Lexington company called People Ready. They urged her to file for unemployment. So the next day she made a claim. But now, over a month later, and she still hasn't received any money. I have not received one paycheck. They sent me a letter in the mail saying that I would get the, the 168 a week. And they also sent me the debit card in the mail. The debit card's active, been active for over three weeks. And I requested two payment or one payment. The other two was already requested. But there's no dollars that's been sent out. Now, bills are starting to stack up. So she's been forced to withdraw her 401k. It's very frustrating. I, you know, I worked a job prior to that and had a small 401k plan, which wasn't nothing but a little thousand dollars. But by the time I get that, you know, I mean, I, I have to help pay some bills and, you know, get food and stuff for mom. So not only will Renata have to start over with her retirement plan, but she says what's even scarier is that she may be forced to go back to work in a place she doesn't feel safe. I would rather not have unemployment and be out there working if people would properly wear their masks and protect us, then I wouldn't be so scared to go back to work. But that, that is the main reason I don't want to go because nobody wants to protect anybody else. Eleanor Buckley, LEX 18 News.